This is question 19 on problem solving from the 2009 TSA. So we're asked, what is the longest time spanned by consecutive public holidays across these eight countries? And given are the dates of any public holidays each month in each of these countries. So what we're looking for in this table is the largest number of con consecutive dates that are shown across these eight countries. So if we start with January, what's the longest span we can see? Well, in country six, you can see that we have 28, 29, and 30. That's a three day span. So this could be a good place to start. Let's also be careful of spans across different months. So you can see many of them in January have the first as a holiday. Then what about December? You can see that the 31st is one, but there's nothing before that. So that's only a two day span from 31st to the first. So moving on, February, clearly it's not gonna be nor March, but what about April? We have lots of holidays here. So what's the longest span we can pick out across all the countries? So we have a nine and a 10 up here, which could be the start of a span. And we can't see any eights, so we know the lowest in the span will be nine. And do we have any 11s? So there's one in country seven. Then what about 12s? You can see we have 12 and 13 in country eight. Are there any 14s? No, so this is the longest span we can get in April, which is five days. So this looks pretty good, but let's carry on just in case. So in May, there's nothing obvious that would be a span. We do have a 31, then we have the one in June, but this will be only be a two day span. So in June, there are no obvious longer spans, nor in July, nor August. We have the 29th and 31st, but that's only a two day span. Then in September, again, the longest we have is a two day span. In October, we don't have anything. We have 31st to the 1st, October to November, that's only two days. Then finally in December, we just seem to have the 25th and 26th as a span. So the longest span that we've picked out is this five day span in April. So this is our answer, which corresponds to D on the question paper.